We're excited to introduce a new feature we've been working on, the Account Mapping Tool. This new tool allows you to group and rearrange your chart of accounts, giving you the flexibility to create a custom reporting structure that fits your organization's needs. To start using the Account Mapping Tool, navigate to the company settings for the company you want to edit. At the bottom of the settings, you'll notice a new section for account mapping. From here, you can enable a custom chart of account structure and launch the account mapping tool. If your company has inactive accounts enabled, they will appear in the mapping tool. So make sure your account visibility settings are correct before launching. When you open the tool, you'll see the different sections of your statements listed in the left-hand menu. You can click on each section to navigate and begin rearranging your accounts. Across the top bar, you'll find options to expand or collapse rows, view the number of unmapped accounts, or revert a section back to its default layout. You can easily drag and drop accounts to reorder them or adjust their hierarchy by placing them under other accounts. At the bottom, you'll also see options to create new account groups or add blank rows. When creating a new account group, you'll be prompted to name it, and you can arrange it just like any other account. Adding a blank row allows you to insert a space or a label between accounts. Simply name it if you'd like it to appear as a label or leave it blank for spacing purposes. When you group accounts, Reach will automatically create a new total for that group. Once saved, you'll see the new group and total reflected in your company's statements, along with any blank rows you've added. If you edit a statement, you'll also notice a new icon next to any blank rows that originate from the account mapping tool helping you easily identify which parts of your layout are being pulled from it. If changes are made to your chart of accounts in your bookkeeping software while using the mapping tool, Reach will alert you at the company level with a warning for unmapped accounts. When you launch the mapping tool for that company, you'll see alert icons on any sections that contain unmapped or new accounts. Clicking into those sections will reveal which specific accounts are affected. From there, you can rearrange and map the new accounts, mark them as resolved, or remove deleted accounts directly through the tool. When working with consolidations, it's important to note that all companies within a consolidation must have the account mapping tool either turned on or turned off. You can quickly toggle this feature per company by returning to the company settings and checking or unchecking the option to enable a custom chart of account structure. Budgets Pro has also been updated to fully support the new account mapping tool. It will behave the same way it does when changes are made to your chart of accounts through your bookkeeping software. If accounts have changed, you'll see warning icons both within the affected accounts and next to the budget itself. You can then choose to reset the statement so it matches the new structure or manually delete and re-add any missing accounts. Keep in mind that resetting a statement will remove any formulas or comments associated with the accounts that were deleted or restructured. This covers the main features and behaviors of the new account mapping tool, as well as how it integrates with your existing budgets and accounting setup. If you have any questions or need help getting started, feel free to send us a chat. Our team is happy to assist.